Before You Get Fit for Brexit with Miss Cherry Hinton, whom I have never touched. There is some great news about Lord Drainlid's castle in the Cloud Health Service. Over to your very own millionaire quack in the virtual surgery. Welcome to your 21st century GP service. There is no need to attend a surgery. Simply download the GP app to your smartphone. That's it. Now point your credit card at your phone to activate my all singing all dancing virtual stethoscope. An initial consultation will commence. Breathe in. And. Breathe out. Breathe in. And. Breathe out. For a diagnosis, please point your credit card at your phone. Your diagnosis will be posted on social media within six months. This consultation has ended. sending us their cars. For this exercise, I want you to strip down to your underwear and form groups of three. Two of you can come together a bit like a pantomime horse and a third can climb on top like a jockey. Now in this formation, walk around the sides of the room at first, then start to trot. No, not that kind of trot, there won't be any after Brexit. As you become more confident, and using the whips provided, I want to see a rising trot that develops into a canter and finally a full-blown gallop. Every time you pass me, stop and kneel. Got the idea, darlings? I'm in the gazebo outside the guild hall. We're waiting to hear what the communist mayor is going to do about the coin operated hot air blowers on lampposts. They was installed by the militant tendency in 1982. According to the opposing Lib Dem party, the blowers that are intended to dry runny noses on during cold weather are outdated and should be removed. The LGBT plus party says they discriminate against people with no noses. UKIP says there's nothing to stop migrants using the service after Brexit and could mean the spread of diseases like rabies. The Conservative Party says we'll all have battery operated ones after Brexit anyway. The Communist Mayor is keeping us waiting for his decision we in the media are calling for his resignation. Skeletal Norman, Castle in the Cloud News Service. I've been told that the blocks of stone on part of peace are not a new chance toilet. Apparently they are public art. When I was at the Royal College in the 1960s I never saw art like that. Anyway, I'm on Mill Road on my way to the Six Bells. I'm at the top of Common Garden and have a tip for smokers suffering under the fascist smoking ban. 
when the pub's in sight, gradually slow down your walking speed to a slow shuffle, and at the same time take bigger and bigger pulls on your tab. That way you're all stoked up for going inside and ordering your pint. See you later, pit lambs.